If you haven't already, please give her a follow. Tune in when you can. She also does keyboard stuff. And didn't the What is that profile called again? Oh, Cat Eternal. There we go. How was the How was the group by? I, I so a couple of days before it ended, I told my local buddy to get it because he loves purple, and and so I told him to get it, and he bought the Desk Man, the Base Kit, and some other kits. I can't remember, but yeah, because he almost forgot about it. I almost forgot about it too. Yes, his name. Yeah, his name literally is Purple on on Twitch and on, on Discord. So hello everybody, uh, Torx. If you want to post your render, sure. And black on black PPT dice up. It depends. The thing is, the one it, they have a few different kinds. Not all of them are the same. The Enjoy PPT one is different from the others. Like they have some with the yellow keys and stuff. The Enjoy PPT one I do not like. Cause that one uses the old Enjoy PPT Legends. And I'm not a fan of the old Enjoy PPT Legends. Same thing with Enjoy PPT Gary. It uses the old, the Gen 1 Legends. And I do not like the Gen 1 Legends. But let's head everybody Torx Fighter, Turnstile, Train the Gamer. 14 by 71. My Xenoversary, a year and eight days so far. Wish me love. It's it's pretty crazy how how long it's been and still still nothing. My lights look kind of weird. Oh well, maybe turn on the yellow light. No. Oh, that's the wrong thing. There we go. There we go, a little better. X Perms, welcome. Chris Tomp. Start minutes shift so you can control alternate DD, go to Windows Explorer. See, the thing is, you can do that. Almost always, it breaks something. Because I usually do that when. Um, the window management, right? Like window snapping and things like that. When that breaks, I do and task Windows Explorer. It breaks other things. And so if I'm streaming, I've had it happen before where, you know, you break some things and then halfway through the stream, you're like, well, shit, I have to restart my computer. And so I didn't want to do that. Might as well just restart straight away since, you know, the I just started the stream. The Twitcher, hello. This is Jordan P. Booby Bep. Daredevil. Vogon PT. Jerk Chicken. PC Lot Letter. <laughs> you see the stream. Tiggle Bit. Salty Strawberry. I like that name. And GB as well. Uh, the burger was actually decent today. They they gave me a lot of extra onions, so that was nice. Way more than usual. Cruise Control TV, hello. Philoop FN. Hello, brother. Apiary Keyboards, hello, hello. So on top of shit. Yes, I walked to the burger place, so I had to put some warm clothes on. DB Jun is also here, Osiris as well. So, so since we have all these people here, Okay, let's do apiary keyboards first. So give these guys a follow, please. And we have Max on deck with their own. I'm warm right now just looking at you. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wow. We could keep each other warm. No flower shorts. Yeah, so I just came back from dinner. That's why I went to go get a burger. My free burger. You have a three PC setup? I have two. One over here that is currently not plugged to anything. And I went back there. My streaming PC is the same as my main PC. 
Hold on, I think my lights are still funky. Hold on. Hold on, and then we'll start the unboxing. Yeah, cuz when I restart, my cameras go weird. There we go. There we go. That looks more normal. Do you have to eat a free burger? No, I just... It's cold outside, so I figured might as well... You know. Well, I didn't just get the burger. I went to go get some things done as well. Uh, get some groceries and everything. Might as well. I don't have enough reasons to... Wear a button-up shirt and sort of some might as well. Stop this the real force around two feet inside a Nobra force. Mm, I want to say no, but maybe I'm wrong. You ever crave pickle juice after you eat dill pickle spears? Maybe it's just me craving vinegar or something sour. Not me. Uh, as much as I like pickle juice with stuff, I never like it on its own. I don't, I just don't like the vinegar on its own. Vinan, welcome to the stream. Yo, bro. Thank you very much. I like I like navy. It's nice. Matches my watch too. Oh great! See now my main camera is broken. God damn it! There we go. We fixed it. Amazing. I love you. Daredevil, thank you so much. 17 months. Thank you, thank you. The watch is a Graf Zeppelin Flatline Power Reserve. With the Sunburst Blue Dial. It's got a Power Reserve Indicator, Date, and 24 Hour Indicator. Yeah, pretty nice. With a Corvin strap. Need a cool watch. You should. You definitely should. Uh, don't get too into it though. It it gets. <laughs> if if you're already spending money on keyboards, you don't want to have a new money pit. All right, so we have Jenkin Metropolis in front of us. So we didn't get a cool reveal because you know this kit is already. It already shows us the colors and stuff, but let's set it aside. We have the space bars as well, which we will take a look at. It's Metropolis. Will people take me more seriously if I have a nice watch? Maybe. That depends on the watch as well. And no, not Led Zeppelin. It's Graf Zeppelin. I know. It's so close, right? Brown and blue don't go get it. Oh man, don't remind me. I still, I still sometimes have conversations with friends about that. It's one of the dumbest things I've heard in my life. Rope, how's it going? Yeah, so we didn't get the Metropolis desk man, I think. And it didn't ship the same time anyway. The Pantheon, uh, fast food burger places where does water burger stand? Now, even though I live in Texas, I've lived in Texas for seven years. I would not consider myself a Texan, and I think that what I'm about to say would probably take away any claim to Texas hood, if I did uh, claim so. I think Whataburger's overrated. I said it! I think there are better burger places for the money, even in Texas. Especially if you're in a city. Now, if you're stuck in bumfuck nowhere in like a rural town, I can see how maybe that could be your only raspit. You know, 
if it's the only place other than IHOP open 24 hours, okay, maybe you need something. But if you're in if you're in DFW, there are so many good places. Just go to any of those. But yeah, see all these Texans are showing up in chat. And this is why. Maybe maybe I do need to get myself a gun. Gotta protect myself from the other Texans. Waterburger is overrated! Moon Bagels, welcome to the stream. Okay, so hopefully I did say hi to everyone already. Oh, the Deathmatch APR keyboards, you should buy this from Amazon. I have all the options. So I have one that's a burger Deathmatch. I have one that's a... I have a magenta one that's that has uh, donuts. And then I have this one. It's the teal one with popsicles. And... And I have a gray one that has shark fin. Oh shit. Yeah, let me get you the link. So you looks like most of the options are out of stock right now. What you can do is wait for mass drop to run them, because mass drop will run them for ten dollars cheaper than MSRP. So twenty dollars instead of thirty. So that's why I bought so I bought the burger one. For 30 from Amazon and then when Master had them I bought four of the others. I bought the other four. You're in Victa Get out of get out of here. <laughs> Dab and end stream. It's okay to say something is over there. Is it good though? Okay, see now 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 I'm now now I'm gonna put myself in, in harm's way because I'm gonna say no. <laughs> I mean it depends though, right? If you gave it to me for free, I'd be like, sure, you know, for a free burger, it's pretty good. If I had to pay money for it, probably not. But again, you know, Texans gonna disagree with me. I welcome their hatred. It's okay. We can disagree on some things. Jenkin Metropolis, so <laughs> I'm not gonna get any more stuff from Turnstile, huh? So Turnstile, the, the guy who sent me Jenkin Metropolis, he will send me a bunch of artisans. He sent me a lot of stuff to, to show on stream. He loves Whataburger. I know. I feel bad for saying I don't. But big shout out to him. We have Jim Game Metropolis here. This was supposed to go on his Xeno, which still has no sign of shipping at all. Uh, I already built a Xeno. But elsewhere, another guy. So, who knows when the Xeno will ship? Because if it doesn't ship out by, you know, New Year's time, you, you will have Christmas holiday come up, we'll have New Year's, so there's gonna be a big break. And then Chinese New Year is in late January this year, instead of mid-February or early February. So it might even extend all the way to February, March, uh, until the Xeno ships, so uh, I don't know. It's gonna be fun. Tinfoil, hello. And then he came dressed ready to argue about burgers. See, here's the thing. I'm, I'm not trying to, you know, I don't go out of my way to, 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 to bat him off. I just don't, I just, the, again though, you know, I could be biased just because of how much people around me like it. Or well, at least back then when I was in uh, Abilene. And so, you go in with this high expectation, and then you, you know, all I got was kind of here. So you know, I'm probably biased that way. If I went in without any hype or anything, maybe it might be okay for me. I <laughs> fear for your life. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Rowley Burger is definitely for sure. I guess it depends because some 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 are really good. All right, so Jim Kim Metropolis, pretty cool. Uh, cover man, see see, I'm I'm glad we got the burger talk out of the way for now. I'm sure we'll, we'll bring it up again. Uh, oh, sorry, have you been to Liberty Burger? It's not bad. It's in Addison. I like their. 
the Napa burger? I can't remember the name. No, the Chilerno. That's the one I like. I've never been to Shake Shack. I, it's only three and a half miles away. I should probably try to make a trip sometime. I just haven't been. Just because I get a free cheeseburger every week. So I just haven't been to other burger places recently. Because, you know, why? I, I don't want to eat burgers multiple times a week. That's terrible for me. Jacob Metropolis. The design is... Uh, what's the word? Mirrored on the back side of this. I'm waiting on my Zeno and I am sending my expectations for like summer 2020. Dude, that's insane. That sucks. Yes, everybody, you are correct. The original group buy was, no, the, the, the way the group buy worked was they had it, yes. The, ori the actual expected ship day was supposed to be a bit earlier. They delayed, they, they, Zeal made sure to account for it. And so he was like, you know what? We're gonna ship May or June because you know, I'm pretty sure it'll be done by March or February, but you know, Chinese New Year, so we're gonna give it enough time. May, June, or April, I think, late April, something like that. April, May, and then, you know, well. Oh man. Okay, so first thing I wanna say, holy shit, the legends, fire. Pop with a with a capital P. They just stand out. Especially with the alphas. It's ridiculous. Uh, maybe I should get this. Should I get another? I should get some. White paper. <laughs> Calibrate your eyes. You found two wireless, a G three hundred five wireless. I mean, those are pretty different mice, though. If you need the extra buttons, G five hundred two. Otherwise, most people would prefer the G three hundred five. I think, or at least it'll work better for most gamers. Three hundred five. I would take the 502 wireless, but that's just because I need the extra buttons. All right, Metropolis. So yes, um, I will say though, if I bought this set, I would have had to buy the alternate uh, mod kit because I am not a huge fan of the Well, we'll see. Maybe it'll grow on me. You know, I could use the main set. That's really not bad. It's quite nice, actually. But yes, look at those alphas, man. Holy shit. That's insane. So nice. Especially on top of the, the navy blue. Mm. It's pretty good. Why does GMK use ABS instead of PPT? Because that's what their molds are for and you can't just replace PPT with ABS using the same molds, they're different materials. PPT is notoriously difficult to work with because of the warping during the cooling process. And so with double shunt, things like that, it just gets really difficult. So that's why they stick with ABS. Lego is also made of ABS. So yeah, so PPT double shot, that's why most PPT double shots that exist look pretty bad, honestly. And also with ABS you can get more vibrant colors. So, let's grab some of these. We should open this thing here.
So I really like the way this set turned out. Personally, I would use the alternate kit for sure. But of course that kind of takes away how unique the set is, right? How many keyboards do you have now? I currently don't have that many anymore. I've sold a lot, I've disassembled a lot of my boards, desoldered them just because I realized back then, you know, I would have keyboards on display and stuff like that, and I've, I've taken all of them down now. Cause I'm not the type that swaps keyboards around. I just use one in my desk and that's, that's pretty much it. So kind of pointless. I'd rather put that money towards some other things or just the space. I right? like, for example, my living room, you know, I've got a bunch of Lego out there now on display instead of Back then, when I had some keyboards in my my bedroom, yeah, I I used to think I wanted to just collect a lot of keyboards, and now I'm just like, nah, I'm fine. Yeah. Especially because I'm not, yeah. I I just don't really care for variety in terms of typing experience. I'm fine with just the same thing, as long as it's something I like. Right, so, oh, the access is still available. Okay, so let's check out the, wait, uh, is it though? It is. Oh, okay, so if you like this set, uh, I will say the end result. I like it more than the renders. They're, they're actually really nice. And at least in terms of the the the, the, the Alpha Legends and and because of the the teal and the navy blue. So we'll look at the yellow and the red in a bit. So still available. Base kit still available. Midnight kit also still available, which is not very common. Typically, they run out pretty fast. But look at that. So it says, taking inspiration from the dazzling lights of the big city, this key set features pops of color set on a strong blue-black base. Wait, blue-black? You mean? Dark blue? Colors draw a close parallel to traffic lights while the novelty icons are derived from classic orientation signage. It includes nine row one N keys. What? Oh, 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 this one. Oh, never mind. Okay, never mind. Extra Nike caps. Wait, does it, it does, right? Okay, see, so it's over here, the thing they're talking about over there. Whoops. Janky Render, hello. Uh, I guess it's not bad. Alright. So. This teal is super nice. Super nice. And I really like the navy as well. It's a shame that GMK Matrix, was it Matrix? Ended up being too expensive to get it. Because... A navy set would be nice. You know, this is a little closer to what Penumbra and GMK Penumbra and GMK Solarize Dark should have been, honestly. 
Because these colors are pretty nice. Now the red is not a red red. It is a it is more of a dark orange. Uh, I think for most people, it is definitely a more orangey red. Not a. Let me get. I think so. My eyes completely trick on me. Uh, let me get. Oh, I, I don't have Hamon anymore. I sold Hamon, but let me get Honeywell red. Who's better than renders? I agree. Isn't dark orange red? No. No, not at all. Dark orange is dark orange, red is red. They could be close, but we're talking. Let's see, so you can see now. So this is the. Orangey red or reddish orange. I would say it's more red, orange, reddish, uh, orangey red, right? Ah, uh, actually, you know what? Now, right beside it, I don't know if. I think orangey red is. Ah, uh, I would just straight up call it an orange, honestly, now that I have it beside the red. Just straight up an orange. See, so this is Honeywell red. You can see now this is clearly red. And now this looks orange compared comparatively. All right, so definitely orange. You can see even the in the renders and stuff, in the pictures, it is an orange. It's just that it might appear red in certain lighting, but I think that once you compare it with something that's red red, it's pretty easy to see the difference. I like this color. I'm a fan of a very strong orange. Okay, so that's Honeyball Red. And now let's compare the the teal to the teal of Hyperfuse. I believe it has a custom color, but maybe? Damn, that looks pretty really close. It is slightly different though. So the Metropolis teal is just a tiny bit more saturated, I wanna say. Tiny, tiny, tiny bit. Now on camera, I think they, I think you can kinda see one, this one is a little more saturated. Very slightly though. Honestly, if, if I don't have them completely side by side, I wouldn't really even be able to tell the difference. Damn, it's definitely hard to show the difference on camera. But you can see this one is a little less saturated, All right? So this one is Hyperfuse Teal, and this is Metropolis Teal. Yeah, so this, the Hyperfuse Teal is just a little lighter, a little bit. Man, I when I um, when I took the set out of the box, this shit, man, so nice, especially with the reverse color. Oh man, so good. Why is it so good? I'm so jealous. I maybe I should have. Not now. I kind of regret not buying it. Now I, someone on the Zero One Discord offered to sell his at cost price. I think. 
Maybe I should have bought it from him because this is this is real nice. Well, I guess. Oh well, I don't know if I would buy only the base set though, right? So I would have had to also buy this because this is this is so good. So again, let's take a look. And the yellow, it is a. Hmm. So I wouldn't say it's a banana yellow because banana would be maybe a little green, right? Uh, and then not a mustard yellow. Mustard yellow is is a little brown ish. Uh, I think the screen's not doing it. I, it is okay. It is kind of like honey mustard yellow instead of mustard. If that makes sense. Right, you know how honey, mustard has a really brown tinge to it? And then honey mustard is like a yellower, friendlier, more cheerful mustard, right? So kind of like that. Uh, I would compare it to... Actually, yeah, honey mustard is kind of spot on. Um, not even a lemon because lemon's way too yellow for it. But it is nevertheless a nice color. I don't know how well it's showing on camera. You know, it's hard to... It's hard to give a good idea of what this yellow looks like, honestly. Um, so this would be a typical post-it note. Well, not typical post-it notes. No, not this color. Um, let's see. Some creamy lemon stems. <gasps> what have I done? Wow, I'm so dumb. Big rip. Was this one here? Maybe? Maybe not. Scrabble fail. James Warner, hello. Yeah, see, so this is a creamy lemon or whatever. All these new switches, man. Where you got mustard from? No, the thing is, mustard is a little. Hold on. I can have that little hint. It's got like a dirty yellow, right? Yeah. See, look at this. How is that not a little brown? Look at that. See? I'm not talking about the bottle. Is there any of honey mustard? Let's do types of yellow. Okay, see, so, if you look at this picture, for example, if I had to pick the closest one, I would say J.K. Metropolis yellow would be closer to this yellow. See, when I think mustard yellow, I think this. These two, or this one. Yes, but very nice color uh honestly it would be nice to see a set of this yellow i think that would be it would make for a nice set this would actually work well with beige like i hate beige sets and white sets because every other set is white or beige but this color would actually work very nicely with with a cream colored set and the teal is amazing the teal looks super good Especially on the navy blue. Like, holy fuck. Look at that. That is amazing. It's everything I want a solarized dark to be. But what? Ah, I wouldn't say cheddar yellow. 
I think I think honey mustard is a good description of this this yellow. Like just a more cheerful, less saturated yellow. Yeah, so this one I'm not gonna open. You know, we already see the colors. I can check all the keys and stuff. Cause the thing is opening this one, then you know, it'll just be a mess. Cause I'll, I'll just put it in a Ziploc bag and it'll be difficult to make sure all the keys are there. Space bar kit, we can open this one up. Let's compare to Zamu one yellow. Let me grab it. Number yellow. And wait, no, this is this is not Serica yellow. Low. Hold on, this is Jimmy Chocolatier yellow. Let me grab Serica yellow. Circa yellow. Now, this I think when most people think yellow, they think this. I like the most basic yellow. This is the Lego yellow. And then you have, let me move some of these away. Okay, I think this gives you a, a good comparison. I do not have Nautilus anymore. Sold that one a while back. But you can see, now this will be closest to mustard. All right, you can see. It's a little darker. More gloomy looking. See penumbra yellow over here. Very light, desaturated. And you've got this punchy ass yellow, the Lego yellow, which was also on Serica. You have this one. So in terms of like how much I like them on a keyboard, I'd probably put this one as number one. This one would be dead last for me, honestly. I'm not a fan of this yellow. I do not like mustard yellow, almost at all. Even though I have a mustard yellow shirt. Um, probably my least favorite. Uh, these two, I guess on the keyboard, this one isn't horrible, maybe, I don't know, but I do like the Lego yellow. I'm biased, though. I like Lego, so difficult. Is that ISO enter pad printed? Uh, no, it is not. Exactly, so you got... Honey mustard, you've got regular mustard, you've got Lego yellow, and then this is like a piss yellow, no, I don't know. I don't know what you would call this. Like a pastel. Hello. Star Trace, hello. Which one's your favorite, the pastel yellow or which one? I, I like the Metropolis yellow. I think it looks very nice. Pastel yellow, anybody? I kind of, this is kind of a, I kind of got debated because in some pictures it looked more beige than, uh, it looked more cream and beige than yellow, so that's why I went for it. And then in the end, the real thing was like a light yellow.
Metropolis, I agree. I think that Metropolis... So yes, Metropolis Yellow and Lego Yellow. Lego Yellow is nice, but I don't know if I would like having a lot of it on a keyboard, you know? I think this one is probably the most gentle on the eyes. Metropolis Yellow. Yes, but very, very nice. And the Metropolis N. Man, just knocked it out of the park. The colors look so fucking fantastic. Oh, man. Yeah, and this set will be sitting here for a while because we're waiting on the Xeno to put on. Machopolis next to it, I like Machopolis just a little more. I agree, yes. See, the thing, again, little yellow for me, as a yellow yellow, I love it. Uh, would I want it on everything I own? Maybe, no, uh, I don't know. Maybe, actually, no, I think about it. You know, little yellow's not bad. But yes, but the Machopolis yellow just... Very gentle. Now chocolatier yellow, not a fan. I'm not a fan of it. Not at all. Ooh. We can compare Penumbra Blue to Metropolis. Compare the two blues. Metropolis on the right, Penumbra on the left. Penumbra has, I want to say, almost a gr greenish hue to it. It's more aquamarine type color. That's why it's more ink, aquamarine. And then this one is more just straight up navy blue, I would say. So, for example, this would be closer to what my sweater is right now. Man, this combo looks so fucking good. God damn. Wait, CXV. Also, hello, Juan and Millie. Did I miss you? Oh no, you, you've been here. You've been here. We're talking about keeping each other warm this Christmas. Okay, so space bars. They got the blocks or whatever, right? So, I don't think I'll open them. We already see all the colors over here. Now, if we didn't have this, I would open these, but. Here you go. Got the split space bars. I really wish they would just make them all con. Wait, no, these? Are these supposed to be... Oh, see, not these two are convex now. That's nice. So we have a 3U. Is it a 3U? No, it's a 2.75. Damn it. Yeah, so I believe that's 2.7, 2.25, and 2. So now these are all convex. Super nice because the older sets all had them concave, which sucks. So now these are all convex. Super good to see. the. So these are typically the keys that go in the middle of your split space bar setup. These are still concave, but it is nice to see these are not convex. Wait, does this fit inside here? Also, people out there, if you guys have the Xbox Game Pass or have Halo Reach, you should definitely, definitely join us. Maybe I'll, maybe I should stream something. We'll see. We'll see if we get enough people tonight. Maybe we can do a quick round of, or a few rounds.
Halo Reach. Just need practice, Trinity. Just need practice. You did well, uh. When did we play? Was it Friday? Right? Because I remember he killed me a few times. <laughs> I lost a few, a few, uh, 1v1s. If you, right now Xbox Game Pass has this deal promo where you pay a dollar, you get three months for free. And if you don't already have Discord Nitro, it also comes with three months of Discord Nitro. If you already have Discord Nitro, it comes with three months of Xbox Game Pass. So you can get, you basically get six months for a dollar. Pretty nice. That's what I'm doing right now. Cause I don't know if I will play it after six months, you know, but hey, a dollar, I'll do it. And if I do like the game that much, I'll pay the $10 and get it on Steam, uh, the $10 price. Yeah, so Friday, most likely gonna be a stream. Uh, we, I'm still deciding between the Key Cult and the Kira 60. It should be one of those on stream this Friday. I'll let y'all know, stick on the Discord. Keep you guys updated. Yeah, so if we play tonight, uh, let me start getting people in the Discord. Maybe we should make a new channel for it, huh? Just just for people who want to play, so we can. Instead of tagging people and stuff. Yeah, maybe I should make a new channel. Okay, so let's look for someone to raid. Thank you everyone for being here, I really appreciate it. It's short stream tonight, so hopefully, cause the semester ends this week. Hopefully, yes. Christmas time, we'll do more streams because yeah, I have a lot of boards uh, coming up that I have to build. Also have the S75 that we have to work on. It's okay, Strike. If we get enough people we'll, for Halo Reach, we'll 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 stream some Halo. Time to study for Calc 2 exam. Well, good luck with that. Uh, don't let us tempt you with Halo. What did I do? I'm gonna look for someone to raid. Somebody. Can anybody find me somebody to raid? So Shay is streaming, so maybe we'll go there. We haven't stream raided her in a while, so. 10 days off. NGB, are you gonna get Halo Reach? I hope you find a burger meant for you someday. Yes. Maybe I'll find a water burger meant for me someday. Maybe I need to try all their burgers to find something I like. Maybe. My favorite is still this ad that. I heard on Spotify before I joined Spotify Premium. It was something about this new onion burger or whatever. So that's why I was kind of interested. Uh, but guy, you know, it's a bunch of these testimonials or whatever. And and this guy goes, it's to, towards the end of the ad. So it's this long ass ad. And you know, it's always twice as loud as the music you were listening to, right? And this guy goes, it's the best burger I had. And so I thought, oh, oh, it's the best burger I had since I've been a water burger. I'm like, why did you have to say that? <laughs> why did you have to say the second part? You know, at first, I was like, best burger I have, man. That's quite a claim since I've been a water burger. Oh, so <laughs> that means nothing. Thank you. Boom, 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 boom. Oh no, all that. Okay, so I, I completely missed the credit, so I have to wait for it to go over again. But mentally, thank you so much for the raid. Resubs, Daredevil, thank you. What's a Whataburger?
Is this Uber oh, uh, Burger Place? The funny thing is how Texans love it. Is it even Texan? Oh yes, it is. It's based in San Antonio. <laughs> so why do why do Dallas people even love it? Come on. Okay, let's look at all the new follows and stuff, and then we'll call it a day. Janky Render for the follow. Thank you, Bobby McBobby. Ricky Bober. Ramuzona. X Perms. This is Jordan P. Minterly with the raid again. Bromadius. Skyward dude. Thank you so much for the follow. And now let's finish off the raid. And yeah, everybody else, I'll see you all on Friday. Uh, those are finals. Good luck. Hope you guys, everyone, please have a good week. I'll see you all next time.